Business promoted, y'all want y'all music on there. Just hit me in the DM. You know, my numbers in the contact on my Instagram, all that. Y'all niggas hit me, man. Stop just sending me your music. Yo, stop just sending me your music thinking I want to hear that shit. <laughs> like, I, I, there's mad music on Spotify, all the other apps I could listen to, bro. I Stop sending me mad shit in my email, bro. I don't want to hear it unless y'all talking about getting on the podcast or doing some business, bro. Real shit. Yeah, yeah can't respectfully. Knock, can't knock the hustle like my nigga you feel me? Word. That's a fact, man. So how was your week, cuz? Man, busy, yo. For we real? just been, you know, working, trying to get this documentary together, shooting vids. I did a, a interview. I did behind the scenes. So. I seen you did a uh, video to the song we intro yeah, with, so y'all yeah, yeah. check that out. You know, Backstreet I mean? Keith, man, y'all look out for that. Okay. That shit coming out. Yeah, got song like, go hard. Yeah, yeah. And it's called on my bully. Back on you my bully, me? you feel yeah, me? For the on my that. bully, you know what I mean? Me? Make sure y'all tap in, you know what I mean? All mm-hmm. my bully candles, yo. So shout out to homie for that track right there. That's your heart, you know what I mean? That's a fact, yo. So what you been up to this week, though? Man, same shit, Brandon. You know, it's first week back to school for the kids. So oh, just facts, shopping, facts, getting facts, all the supplies facts. and all of that back together. Making mm-hmm. sure they get to bed on time and all that. So we just trying to keep it together, you know, regular shit, man. It's just always, fresh. always family first over here, cuz. And y'all know all these episodes is sponsored by Born Original, man. Yeah, man. Y'all know y'all tap, yeah, tap, man. Man, tap, man. Turn, tap. Yo, which which all flavor you trying to push some of this thong? Man, we got you the said pineapple. Rush last yeah, time. last week was Rush Press, but we got Pineapple Express too, man. You you heard, heard, yeah, yeah, right yeah, here, yeah. man. Pineapple Express, you, heard? you know what I mean? Hard, man. Pineapple, just like the Coca Loso, but we got a little, you know what I mean? You know what I mean? You heard? So make sure you tap in, man. We Get got your all shit, your right? favorites. You heard? That's a fact. You still got the gravel going too? Yeah, man. man. We got the gravel going on. You know what I'm saying? The hot gravel, mm-hmm. you know what I mean? Make sure y'all tap in, man. We're doing great, man. Keep playing. With that, what we, we, we going to take this shit? What we going to start this shit off with? Man, I'm thinking we should stick. take it all the way to New Orleans with it. Where? Yes. Yeah. Oh man. Here I come. Yes. Yo. How she go? Here I come. Whoa, 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 whoa. Hold on, though. We got the shots pulled up. Yeah, Before yeah, yeah. we start, we gotta start to stay off right. So I got a chance to you, cuz of oh. two amazing episodes. Oh. Going Let's crazy. Do this. My fault. Seven. We lit. Yeah, you seven. That we lit. lit. Fuck out of here. We lit. Try to give me the down <laughs> Nah, he a pro. Don't let him capture you. Yeah. <laughs> with a little shot. But yeah, so you want to go to the NO with it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's what yeah, we got right, into. Well. I ain't going <laughs> to. But nah, listen though. I heard this not the first time, bro. Got caught nah, up. this bro. like he just did mad time for race. See, bro. I didn't even know none of this because, you know, I ain't. I ain't in tune with like, you know, I just nah, heard a couple. Yeah, he like, oh, Mr. Cole, I ain't gonna hold you, you know yeah. what I'm saying? But he like before your time. Like, yeah, but you, nah, <laughs> you know what's the thing? I've seen that? him in, what's that movie? Um, 
with Silk the Shocker. Oh, uh, Hot Boys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah and I've seen this nigga had a fucking... Yeah, uh, extensions. Yeah, and it's yeah, yeah. like, oh, this shit. nigga That was his shit. He had, nah, the, he was wild, he had the extensions with the bottle, With the bottle. Yeah, 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 it was different. Was yeah. wild, bro. That's how they was giving it up down there in New Orleans. You heard me? But nah, you feel me? Like, I ain't know. Just from that, I seen a zesty nigga that was willing to do whatever. And then this nigga was supposed to be hood with it? Yeah. Nah, that's that's... I should have seen the red flags from back in the day. Well, my thing is, bro, my thing is, bro, in 2022, mm -hmm. this is not the time that, yo, bro, you can't even ask a female for her number in an aggressive way. Like, you can't even you do can't that. You can't even approach a female. Nah, that that's what I'm saying. Like, how could you even, so I'm, I could imagine that. Let's just mm -hmm. say he did half of what he was allegedly accused of doing yeah. back in the day. Today, oh, it's oh, gonna they're gonna throw the book at this guy. Hopefully, you know, I'm I'm always pushing black innocence, you know what I'm saying? Cause Yo. we we already got so much, you know what I mean, outlets that's gonna already have him guilty until proven innocent. Yo. So let's just say not guilty, you feel me? Cause we <laughs> Yo, don't we know. Speak. You want you want me to speak real though? Yeah, speak your opinion. Speak your mind. Yo, speak your mind, yo speak your I ain't gonna lie, yo. This nigga need to just go sit in that, go do his time, bro, cause Yo, you could tell he did that shit, bro. You right. know he did that shit. What bro. was he accused of? What was he accused of? Bro? <laughs> they said this man was accused. On a, I don't even know who, what, what, what it was, but I heard it was the third charge. Yeah, this, this is third, third time. time. Yeah, like, this is third. And this time. my thing is like, yo, if you was known for that and all that, like, bro, you, if you known you was out here like that already, wouldn't you just chill? Yeah, but you, this is the thing, though, bro. Like, you got to look at the... Because, honestly, right, He the mm -hmm. thing that he went to jail, because he did a lot of prison time for it yeah. the first time, mm -hmm. what he necessarily went to prison for the first time, he told the situation about what happened, right? Yeah. And as far as I'm concerned, like, I don't think, like, the people would have, like, messed with him mm -hmm. if he was... Bro, like if he, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, when he explains his situation, mind you, it's paperwork to go along with it. Mm -hmm. So I'm sure real homie, whatever, rather than seeing what was going on, and um, you know what I mean? Yeah, Gave him the pass, side. like yeah, 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 probably because you know one but thing. The third time. Yeah, like what see, and then like, he the second time. Come on. This was since he had got out, and then. I don't know it. That nothing came of it. Like it got, you know. He probably paid some bread. Who knows? You know what I'm saying? That shit is wild. But then the third time is just like, you know, homie, yeah, you might need to get a like wife that. and yeah. settle down. This is the thing when you being a male chickalo at, you know what I'm saying, at an old age. You know what I mean? It's just like you gotta, yeah. He gotta get a, sit down, bro. Yeah, he gotta sit down, bro. He gotta relax. Like, he gotta got relax. bread, bro. What wasn't you doing, Vlad? Interviews. I know Vlad break bread with the niggas. Nah, too. he don't be break Vlad. Be baking, breaking bread with people. Certain ones. Yeah, like, like, like the, like the, yeah, because like okay. him and Boosie got rapport, but like he only, st he just started doing that. Mm. He just started breaking bread with people because like the people that was locked in with him before, like Lord Jamal and dudes, they wasn't getting no money and they was doing, oh, nice. they was going viral. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so, right. and he'll pay like the street dudes, like the old dudes that did like 20, 30 years, come home. He'll he'll pay Cause them because they niggas. Not only really that, but it's just like shit. You need to get. You know what I'm saying? Some yeah. I don't feel like he it's paid so all of them. I don't think he, he paid all of them. He said he don't pay for interviews. Nah, he do now. He he yeah. admitted to it that he do pay because I know okay. he paid Birdman brother. He gave him some yeah, bread. They making is. money. So yeah, nigga, not he not giving that story up. Nah, nah, for, for free. Nah, yeah. hell nah. And he Black, know Black, how much he can Black make. Black probably gave him like 5K, something small, something light, nah, just to hold think, him over. I think and Slim, the remember Slim in, in his head. Yeah, but they not, they not they locked in like that. Not no, nah, uh, Slim was giving him bread. He the one who really fucked Yeah, him. yeah, but I'm saying like Slim and, and him is not locked in like that. If he just gave Slim. him some bread, looked out for him. He not locked in like that, cause Birdman ain't gonna allow that shit, bro. Birdman yeah, 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 wants to right. fuck that nigga shit. You feel me? So, I don't yeah, know though. Every man make their own decisions though. You yeah, know what I mean? But yeah, that. But yeah, that shit for him. That to be his third time is just some, some crazy shit. So you think he going? What you think the outcome I going to be? I can't respect no man that already. You got one charge. I'm already look at you different. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like and then now this is the third, bro. Like. I ain't fucking with you, like, 
I already wasn't, you know, I already knew a couple songs from this nigga. Like, yeah, it's cool, but like, on yeah, the other nah, end Mystical that, Legend, bro. Yeah. I just, I don't know. Maybe he got some issues. Nah, that shit like it out. took from him, bro. That shit yeah, like it took yeah, from yeah. him. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They took it from R. Kelly. Yeah, they, they going super dead. They, they going to take that nigga. They this nigga quit. This nigga going to have a fucking <laughs> niggas that go, Mr. Who? Yeah, who? <laughs> yeah, Mr. Who? That nigga gonna be called that's Mr. Nice. Re. That nigga ain't gonna be Mr. Re. That's mystical. Nice. They gonna change that shit to Mr. Re. That's nice. They ain't gonna know who that nigga was, for real. They took R. Kelly shit. Yeah, yeah. shit, you on thin ice, homie, for real. You better correct that shit, for real. I don't know. Like, mystical, though. Mm -hmm. This nigga is done. He just yeah, gonna be he's sitting a, there, bro. You think so? I don't know. Yeah, we'll see how it play out. He gonna have to get it like a regular nigga, bro. Like, because the niggas in prison is not respecting the nigga who, yeah. like, you had a record before, yeah, that's cool, like, but you might be in here for the rest of your life now, that shit don't matter. So all that shit with that record shit don't matter. Why? Yeah, and there'd always be some kidnapping shit with that nigga, like, like he always holding hoes against their will, man. Like, let them hoes go, bro. man. Like, come on, Mr. bro. Mr. Will, let them hoes go, man. <laughs> like, if they want to go, let them go, bro. That should be getting you in big trouble, bro. Like, cut it out. Like, what's wrong with this man, fact, bro? bro? Like... Yeah, you got his girls up for real, bro. Yeah, <laughs> stop locking the door on these bitches, bro. Let them out. Unlock the door. They want to leave. Just yeah. let them leave, bro. Let them free, bro. Let these hoes is free, bro. <laughs> <laughs> it's not slavery time, bro. Like, let these hoes go, bro. Like, if you want to go, let them go. It's, it's not, not worth it. It's just giving you bad looks. Yeah, I can't defend you. I'll fuck with you, but I can't defend you. Because you look like, I ain't going to lie, you look like what they saying you is, bro. Like, the first time, because you could tell, like, you'd be like, damn, word, they did that. You'd be like, wow. Then second time, you like, whoa, they fucking with you, ain't it? <laughs> Third time, I was like, nah. Nah, you nah, know. Nah, nah. <laughs> Did you do that shit, yeah, bro? Yeah, like, like, what's up with you, bro? Like, like, nah, why you always getting caught up in these situations? I don't know. Stay out the way, bro. Yeah, like, this is a fight. Cut it out. Like, let these hoes go. So, speaking of Tom, though. Yeah. Brittany Grimes. It's like the biggest story. Yo, niggas is ODing on this story right now because it's like, she... This is how I feel on it because I ain't going to come into this shit with feelings and none of that. Mm-hmm. Now, you know, like, I'm going to be real. You know, niggas be traveling mm -hmm. with Bud. You know, we ain't trying to incriminate nobody. Mm -hmm. Now, you know the chance you taking when you flying <laughs> with that shit, right? Mm -hmm. In the back of your head. Now, you know, if you start seeing some weird niggas around while you at the carousel, while you trying to get your bag, mm -hmm. leave that shit alone. You know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? And walk off. Now, you, you know what I'm saying? With that. I can't feel bad for you. You flew with, you knew what you flew with going into across the, the country. Yeah, in a like, place like bro, Russia? What's Russia? wrong with you, bro? It's like, I can't, I can't sit here and have like some type of like sympathy for you because you knew the consequences, bro. Yeah, man. Like, and my thing is too, a thing like, they trying to have a petition to free her or whatever, or mm -hmm. get that shit done, like, but let's think about it. When Meek had the petition, Mm -hmm. Was there a lot of people saying the difference between it? Like, oh, nah, he was riding a... Meek really wasn't doing shit. There was no drugs involved. He was just really riding his bike. And they mm -hmm. saying that's violating. And they wouldn't let him out. And he sat two years for that. Yeah, but that's in America, though. Like, like that, in another you know, country, yeah. like, I ain't going to hold you. Like, in, uh, people going to other countries from America, sometimes mm -hmm. I ain't going to hold you. Like... We as Americans, like we feel like we can just do whatever we want everywhere. I ain't gonna hold it because I'm I'm a nigga like that. You but know what I'm saying? You know your country. I, I know what it is. I know what it is. Like, you know, but you know what I'm saying. So it's just like you just gotta put your, put yourself in a position to not even think about. You know, mm -hmm. even if you gotta, you know what I'm saying, be in there to um to to provide for your family. It's a it's a iffy, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Because it's just like you gonna have to give up the button, you know what I mean? But I heard she did like some good things, like you know, for our community. She was a you know a good person. Mm -hmm. I heard that, but still, at the end of the day, like you gotta know your consequences that come with certain shit. It's like I heard the like Dubai, they they going crazy if you go over there. Yeah, 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 like, yeah. You know yeah. what I'm saying? They have um, DJ Esco. They had DJ Esco. That, for that some 56 Man yeah, shit. That was influence. Like, yeah. that showed you from back then, don't go out the country mm -hmm. with some bud. You know, mm -hmm. or try to do anything where you can't but get But she probably been doing this for years, running around, doing, That's you know what I'm saying? Hug, People get bro. caught up, you That's know what I mean? Hug, running bro. around, comfortability. But yeah, like, but honestly, I... 
if it was like because you know what i mean like mm-hmm. <clears throat> say for instance um the ball kid leangelo right mm-hmm. he went to china yeah his him and his man supposedly stole some some louis glasses allegedly right mm-hmm. they didn't even get caught at the store the, the damn Chinese shit is all under surveillance. They followed them niggas back to the hotel, yeah. came back and locked them up. You know what okay. I'm saying? And Trump went back and got them and all that. But it was just, it was a crazy situation. But they still, you know what I'm saying? It's yeah. still like, if you, you got to respect the law of the land when you yeah, go there. Exactly. Like, that's what it all exactly. falls on. Because it's like, you, it's like, you, you are, you are blood. Mm-hmm. You going to L.A., you going to Slauson, and mm-hmm. you know it's rolling sixties over there. You gonna go banging and shit hard. No, you gonna go do that. You from you? You ain't gonna make it out alive. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So it's just like you. I see it in ways like that. You know what I'm saying? And it's like people gotta see it like that. Like Brit, Brittany, like you bugging, bro. <laughs> like, like what she made you think at, that? But like, I know she was looking at it like. But she is a nothing. point seven. Yeah, a point seven. It like it's you facing nine years for a point seven? No, she got nine years, bro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah she, she got not that facing shit. nothing. They, she, they and they gonna give her that time served for that shit. And she been sitting for how long? Like seven months or whatever. Like almost, I don't even That's know. That's crazy, bro. Like, but it's like I still, couldn't imagine. Damn, a nigga point get seven, jammed, bro. Yeah, she like, got nine years for a point seven in a vape. Like it wasn't even crushed. Like nah, you know, but it's it, you know that they you know even in the state like in legal in illegal states yeah they give you more you it's it's a bigger charge for concentrates mm-hmm. more than it is for uh actual like, for actual flour. Mm-hmm. So I don't know if it's like that there. Like I don't know if that makes a difference because a yeah. girl had got caught up with um they said like some some little white girl got caught up with like seventeen mm-hmm. grams. Mm-hmm. Uh, but this girl got caught up with a point seven, right? That's some liquid. Yeah. I don't know. They just said she got caught up with seventeen grams. I'm thinking like actual flour. It might be flour, but the, listen, shit, you ain't rolling she, with that in no pen though. So nah, nah. Seven. So she got caught up. Yeah. She ended up only serving two months and um and paying like fifteen thousand or whatever their money is called. What country this was? The same Russia. Oh. And shit. Brittany Griner. Turn around, she got to pay a million and she got to do nine years for a point seven. But my thing is, it is it the because she had concentrate and you know this other I girl think, had flour? You know what I think it is? Is the time it, it the time of the, the like war, the too? Is like, yeah, the war like, is a major think about difference. It. If if it wasn't all this inflation and all this shit going on, they using her as an example. Oh hell because yeah! Because it's like, yo, we holding her hostage just to show y'all, like, we not playing with y'all niggas. Like, no, it's not only that. Girl. America is level. funding billions of dollars to the uh, people that they're fighting against. Yeah. So it's like you putting my ops on. You giving them bread and then you want me to free this chick because she like, wants to come in with a... Like, and then flying back and forth <laughs> yeah, to my you, shit. Like, yeah, yeah, getting money. She ain't even checking in. Like, right, you know right. what I'm saying? Getting like, money <laughs> and then she coming in. So I don't know. You feel? My thing is just, where's that other community that she represented? You know exactly. what I mean? Because it just yeah. seems like it's just us. You know, That's all the time when it's tragedy yeah, 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 that yeah. got to step up and speak up and cry out for people. I ain't going to lie. That LBGT, if y'all was to go like a like, million percent behind yeah, us, she'd yeah. be free. Like y'all right should. Now. Like they should. Yeah, like, like they should, bro. Like, like they how they should. would under any They should be comment. going harder than us right now. Because exactly. she's representing them even more and she's a superstar you feel exactly. what i'm saying like you know so i don't know that's a fact that's why i was just like it's confusing to me you know what i mean but at the same time i do feel bad because i do feel like nine years is extreme that's od you know what i mean like, but it's in another country you would have never though. had that in america exactly nowhere in the states but you took that risk yeah you want to go get the bag and, but you want to smoke weed you yeah, gotta like, make come on, bro, your like bro. choose one yeah it's like, grown man shit i ain't gonna lie it's, it's, it's a lot of niggas in yeah. prison in america for life because it was a split decision or they chose they wanted to do whatever they felt like you know what i'm saying not respecting mm-hmm. the law of the land and it's a mistake and ain't no letter and ain't nobody fighting for them. That's Just right. like if I went over there or you went over there with weed. You think niggas would even hear they us? They don't give a fuck. But niggas wouldn't even <laughs> hear our story. Until we've been in there for bro, two years. I'm not getting nine years. That's because she got good lawyers and all that. 
We get in 25. <laughs> yeah, that's 20. a fact. 20. You feel what I'm saying? Because a nigga years. got caught in Dubai that was normal, a regular nigga mm-hmm. got 20 years. Damn. Just for, for having a CBD. No, no, no TAT was See, found I'm good, I'm good on them places, bro. Like, I'm and not that places going there, bro. probably good on me. I'll go there when I'm older. You heard? I don't want to smoke. smoke. Exactly. I just want to drink or something. Yeah. You feel me? They probably been doing that. But it's like when I'm not pressed over that stuff, that's when I'll go exactly. and explore the rest of the world. Right. If, I, if God will not make yeah. it. But I'm not going out my way right now to go to Russia. You feel me? You know what I'm saying? And you know what I mean? And I know the the only way, not a How long way. has she been going to Russia? Like she ain't played. Like how no, you ain't get a plug? Who's supposed to been found you a weed And you over here bringing your pen, bro? Like I know she was playing. I know Russia got weed, bro. Yeah, in the comments, who in Russia got the gas, Word, bro? We were a bro. Rock, bro. Tap it. Yeah, like, Come stop getting up. these NBA players, That's WNBA <laughs> players caught up while they for doing summer league and all That's that. Like, get them right, yo. I know Russia got you some gas, bro. Some nigga on the low puts in some good gas, bro. Word. Even if it's block work. You That's feel me? Get it's these cold, too. Something. Like, it's cold, so I know it's nothing but endo. It's nothing but gas in Russia, bro. She was <laughs> tripping, bro. <laughs> She was better at going to the and you go to the airport with a point seven, man. You, you bugging out. You bugging out. She could have your man Shump, bro. Yo, I heard Shump, Shump yo. is in America though, bro. Shump this is not gonna get mine yet. This is my How much gas does Shump have, bro? How this much man get like six zips, right? Six zips. Oh my mud. god. But this is my thing, bro. Where the fuck you traveling that you can't in America that you can't get that same butt at, bro? Nah. Like, what you trying to you be the like, plug? Yo, you've been playing basketball for years. You've been in every, every state. Where it is, except for where they ain't a team, and if it ain't a team, bro, then niggas really ain't going. Bro, there. even fuck that, even that. His girls, Tiana and Taylor, nigga. I know she don't took you to Amsterdam, all them fucking places, and you over here traveling with six, six, six. Ounces. Yes, nah, that's disrespectful. Yourself, bro. He's disrespectful. Yourself. Bro. He's, like, di- he's different, bro. Like, in like his he's, bag, that man. nigga's on some straight outlaw Tupac shit, bro. This nigga from Chicago, Yo, like, bro, TSA, them niggas be on it like Hawks, too, boy. What? I, I mean, was, you a star. You done, che- you done put your bag in like, y'all want to check it. this joint in. <laughs> them niggas look like, oh, let me double check this nigga shit. You don't never know. You probably had that nosy TSA agent. He probably that smoked a spliff on the way to the airport. Smelled smelled like, like, boy. Yeah. <laughs> When the nigga ain't probably, he ain't fucking, he ain't, what you would call it, he ain't vacuuming that shit or nothing. That nigga just got, had that shit yeah, three right zips in each pocket. <laughs> like, what the bro, nigga, up. I'm shook, nigga, I got the gas, what's up? I'll serve one of you TSA niggas right now if you ask me correctly. Yo, he thought his face call was good. So nah. Get him through, bro. He probably, he another one that probably been doing that shit for years. Just yeah. walk through the airport with a QP. Mm-hmm. Oh, shop. Look, yeah, ah. Cause yeah, it, fuck out of here. I know Shot, he did, he nigga signed two. Contract, right? Nah, he's done. But yeah. He, <laughs> that nigga signed two fucking autographs for the TSA niggas come through. Mm-hmm. Niggas know he got the weed in the pile or something. They was like, oh, we got one. Yeah. He had that, he had that fucking Karen. And it was like, oh yeah, we gonna get the fuck. I don't care about who this celebrity is. Where the hell was he at? Him. Where was he at? I don't even know where the fuck this nigga was at. He but had still, to be in a, a legal state. Yeah. Because I heard in legal states, mm-hmm. legally they can't lock you up for walking past TSA with weed. I, that's what mm-hmm. I heard. I don't know. As long as if it ain't a firearm. Because yeah. I never seen them say on the sign when I'm going at the airport, yeah. no weed. No cocaine, none of that. Heard I just seem to say no weapons and no knives That's and no fact. liquids. That's a so, fact. nigga, at the end of the day, in certain states, if I'm if I'm mistaken or something, I'm, I might be wrong. Mm-hmm. Shit, if you go in the airport with a little gas, mm-hmm. TSA might see it. They might fuck with you. They might not, bro. You feel me? Let's. We gonna be real on here, right? We gonna be real. I done flown to Vegas mm-hmm. or multiple places with weed. Mm-hmm. And I checked my bag in, mm-hmm. and I am gay caught. You know what I'm Damn, saying? Damn, nigga, you gotta cut that out. Like, you nah, 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 I'm saying, no, I'm saying, yeah, I ain't no, telling y'all how I did it, but yeah, I've done it. Like, I'm not even yeah, one of y'all right. niggas flew yeah. back from Vegas with some weed. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> yeah. Like, and I ain't get caught. 
Mm. This nigga had to be being loose, bro. Yeah, he, he, he had, had, had to be on him in his pocket, bro. bro. He ain't get for Yo, when I'm telling you, I double. Yo, when I was rapping that shit for my life, and I even was saying, I said, yo, if you see anybody that look weird going by that shit, we are not getting that bag. <laughs> you feel what I'm saying? This nigga probably was like, oh, I'm a, I'm a slide through this real quick. Nah, you know I feel like saying? he went through TSA with the fuzz, with the. Yeah, six he six, had bro. to he smell. Had to. Yeah, bro, he was wild. I think bro. he was just on some shit like. Nigga, that nigga was, just, that nigga was watching the shot. That nigga was in the shot. <laughs> that nigga was like, yo, fuck it. I'm that nigga in the shot right now. I'm walking fuck through that nigga shit, yo. I'm getting the bag. And then you ain't he ain't been in the league about a good three, two, yeah. three years. Niggas don't know he you no more. Nigga, nigga, like, who this tall? He getting that to y'all like, like, yo. Who this tall? <laughs> they asking for autographs. They like, who this tall? Like, hey, stand over here, tall ass nigga. Search his ass. The What's in this nigga bag? What's in this nigga pockets? Oh, bro. Red flag. He like, hold on, I'm, I'm not. We don't he know. He got you. this jewelry on, nigga. You was yeah. Like, 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 who you play for? for? <laughs> they be like, who you play for? They be like, yo, I'm retired. Nah, nah. Get your oh, ass. Yeah. yeah, get your ass over here. Nigga got the whole bag on him. He's nigga a start fretting. Don't know what to do. Nah, man. niggas be too gangster for their own good, man. I'm good. Speaking of that, R. I. P. Bill Russell, man. Yeah, shout out to that Bill man. Russell. Eighty-eight. I ain't gonna lie. I, I thought, thought he, he was never old. old. I, I thought, thought he was way old. old. I thought that was like a hundred and eight. Bro, I didn't know he never was gonna <laughs> die for real. Like, damn, yeah, like sad. to be real, like he was one of those niggas I thought was like Morgan Freeman. <laughs> like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, like and, the same my whole life. Yeah, and it's yeah. like my thing is he been doing shit for the community too. He been mm-hmm. doing shit for pioneer the community. For like sure. he's a real pioneer. Man, like, he played for Boston, won them mean? eleven rings, right? Bro, and he was in one of the most racist places ever. Can you imagine playing for Boston back then, bro? In your own city, you playing for them niggas don't even want you. And you winning them. Yeah, you winning them. Like I ought to be like fuck y'all niggas. Yeah, if Bill Russell was white, like what's that other nigga name? Um, like um, Luke Bill Walton. If Mm -hmm. Bill Walton was what what. He'll be celebrated crazy way more. He'll be like the logo. You don't even hear people talking about Bill Russell passing nah. too much. It was they gave him a day of a post. Mm-hmm. You feel what I'm saying? But it's like that nigga need to get put first off. Jerry West need to get took off the the logo anyway. Like so. I been thought he need to get took off the NBA logo anyway. Mm. So I'm just saying that because they've been. Other iconic people that came after this nigga that did some crazy shit. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah. But yeah. I think he but he like the foundation though, cause he, he made them, he built their shit. You know what I'm saying? But people done curved it. He know he alive. He gotta pass that joint. It's yeah, like, he don't even got no championship. That's what I'm saying. Yeah, like, like as a player, and somebody on your legacy then surpassed you with so yeah, much plenty shit. Of people. Give it to Kobe, nigga. You think or, so? Uh, Kobe or, like, because Jordan ain't dead yet. Nah, Jordan's so like, goofy. Please don't give him Yeah, because they, they gave him enough. enough they gave bro. him enough All already. these stupid-ass colorways of these Jordans, nigga. <laughs> yeah. I ain't fucking with these shits. Jordan I can't find robbery. nothing in the stores, nigga. <laughs> like, you tripping. Online yeah, either. Nah, don't Money, give it to nigga. Jordan. <laughs> I say give it to, they could give it to Kobe because Kobe, Kobe ain't alive no more. Yeah, like, I don't think if Kobe in. was alive, niggas would be saying give it to Kobe. I don't know who they. I ain't gonna lie, they'll probably be saying give it to LeBron. I think the only person that would have <laughs> other like that would have deserved it other than Kobe would be uh, Will Chamberlain. Nah, hell no. Nah. He scored a hundred points. That's nobody yeah, ever. He was scored. You gotta nobody. understand, it, yo, bro. It's like still he, he would have never been able to do that today. Nowadays, bro. yeah. We That's understand. what I'm saying. Like he's playing but against plumbers. It's a record, though. Nah, it's nobody a record. It's ever fans, scored that. But bro. It, to me, over time, it's irrelevant if you can't like his his like let's just say like it's just like money. Mm-hmm. Like a, a million dollars mm-hmm. in 1920 ain't a million dollars today. It's, mm-hmm. it's like. A billion. If you had if you had a million dollars in nineteen twenty, yeah. that network is now a billion dollars today. So, so what I'm saying is, I say yeah. that to say his fifty point, his a hundred points is really like a 30, 40 point game yeah, to me today. Is. Yeah, yeah you know what I'm saying. And I ain't no disrespect or nothing to take away. This from is how him. I see it. Mm-hmm. Back in the day, why they didn't give it to Will Chamberlain instead of uh, Jerry West? Nah, cause I think Jerry, I think Will came from another league though. But that's still though, ain't no man at that time or still to that to this day 
on point record scored a hundred points in a game. Now, that's why you gotta look at Kobe different because Kobe did. Eight he did two. it in this new time. Yeah, that's what I'm one. saying. That's why I yeah. say give it to Kobe. Yeah. Fuck all that old school shit that was <clears throat> going on because niggas wasn't getting crossed. Because Kobe niggas actually done. wasn't against some real competition, exactly. like some more more high level mm-hmm. of competition. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? And Wait, who that game? Who he played? Was Toronto. it the Sun? Toronto, yeah, okay, Raptors, okay, okay. Yeah. I think Jalen Rose is guarding that mm-hmm. one. Crazy, but See, that's what I'm saying. Mm-hmm. So like Kobe to me love. is like a higher level because yo, bro, mm-hmm. I'm a, I ain't gonna hold you. I went to a, a, a couple of games, bro. Yeah. Last last year, last mm-hmm. season, bro, they ain't not even playing defense no more. No. They not, league, bro. bro. They just stand around, bro, and just wait for whoever. That's why niggas be shooting like crazy. If niggas mm-hmm. was really playing like hard. Cool, like, like back, back in the day, day. Patrick, you oh, them ever we like, would have great games. What well, niggas be knocking these niggas on their ass so much they wouldn't even, bro. They wouldn't even have the legs bro. to run and dazzle and do all that bro. shooting from the. It's nah. the it's the reps too with all these soft ass calls they got. Yeah, but you know yeah. who made the soft calls? LeBron. Fuck <laughs> nah, <laughs> Jordan, Jordan. Bro, you tripping? Nah, LeBron. You bugging, bro? You Jordan LeBron for sure, King, bro. man? Nah, hell no, nah, hell no, nah, hell no. Nah. You got cut out off nah. the rip. What we definitely not gonna do is no LeBron slander on this show. Oh, uh, hey, you know what I mean? That's I give fact. it to LeBron. He the greatest right now, that of our generation, nah, he's the of the generation. Ever. That, nah, ever because bro. if he was out with Jordan and them, he was not in that era. He was not. Let me making tell you, it. nah. Let me tell average. you why. Let me you know he would have been a Clyde Drexler. Nah, you bugging LeBron. Yes, you're, you're in smoking. that time frame, yo, there was crack. too many greats that was out nah. that he was not gonna be able to get away with it. Nah, he would have violated me. LeBron, Hakeem Olajuwon, niggas is still not. There's nobody that's built like LeBron to this day, bro. Going it's not to even, the hole back in the day, Sean would have been, bro. He would have Look what Shaq did. Look what Shaq was yo, doing. Yo, there's no way. Look what Shaq was doing. Shaq was mauling these these niggas yo, when he came up. What, yeah, what's the nigga on the Spurs name? David. Duncan. David. Oh, uh, Robinson. Yeah, that yeah, he was not getting past him, bro. His get no, past him. LeBron would not get past that nigga oh, back bro. in the you day. You said bro. Jordan was getting past these niggas, That's bro. Jordan. Look at Jordan's side. I'm talking about physique compared to LeBron's, bro. Well, look, nah, let's talk about okay. prime LeBron. LeBron was like two, two eighty six eight. He was yeah, yo, bro, yeah, yeah, yeah. fast as hell, yo, bro. These niggas like John Starks. Think about who would've been guarding LeBron. Like, yeah, let's yeah. say Latrell Sprewell. Mm-hmm. LeBron's coming at you full speed. Them niggas is getting the fuck out the way. Now nah, they Scottie were just Pippen. been fighting this nigga. Though. Yeah, exactly. LeBron, LeBron bro, but just that's the thing. Then throw they would've, they would've brought them points down because LeBron would've never been able to score that much. Nah, he, he would've been LeBron. fighting so much. He would've never been a great like that because he would've nah, been I fighting. LeBron so much. would've took shit over, bro. This has been a couple of even Steph Curry. I think. It's a few niggas like Anthony LeBron, Mason Steph with a lock. Curry. Nah, Anthony Mason would have locked LeBron down back you, in the day. Yo, you smoking, bro. You nah. Know, you back ain't smoking. Day, that's the problem. We ain't back smoking. in the you day. Ain't smoking. Nah, that's yo. the problem. You probably yo, don't need to roll up. Y'all, y'all name a 90s. Nah, like Anthony 90s. Mason from my hood, bro. We went to the same high school, bro. So it's yo. not a love. R.P. to him. But nah, Anthony bro. Anthony Mason would have locked LeBron, LeBron, LeBron down, nah, bro. bro. LeBron would have been nah nah you see LeBron how he flopped now if a nigga put some hard defense on him. He got that shit from Jordan. Yeah, but look, and Anthony Mason was guarding Jordan and he was putting that pressure on Jordan. Nah, nigga, hell no. Nah, Come nigga. on. John Starks was that was saying it's before your time. Come bro. on, man. John Starks that footage. John bro. Starks had to, to guard <laughs> Jordan, bro. And Jordan was cooking John Starks. And, and I you know, know what Steph Curry? Look, you know what Steph Curry you know what's crazy? Was gym, did the I was John born Starks. I was born that night the Knicks played I think uh the Chicago Bulls and uh what's his name did the crazy the crazy uh, 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 uh I was born that night. Nigga, so I saw the game that night. That I'm trying to tell you what the fuck is that? <laughs> It's a different hit when it's happening in reality, bro. You was born that day. I was yo, watching the game, bro. Just know it's it different. Bro. That shit, yo. I'm telling you, bro. I don't know, bro. I, don't I just know. I fuck with LeBron mainly because of his all his all around. Yeah. If you want to talk about the, that's why I say he the greatest. Mm-hmm. When you want to talk about the total package, you feel me? Of just 
how an NBA player man should be, that's yeah. what LeBron is, bro. I'm He's a good family yeah. man. He ain't never had no controversy. Like, even yeah, Kobe, rest in shit. peace to him, yeah. but he had that shit on his name. Jordan had this little smile on his name with the gambling and shit. Mm -hmm. It's like, all these, you feel me? Shaq had the smile on his name with the hoes. Yeah. LeBron ain't nothing. And then he That's hoop at an elite level. He got and these his sons. Ones. Yeah, it's, it's, it's going too. You feel me? Yeah, so you know, mm -hmm. like that's that's really why I give it up because it's just like that's one less nigga that give the masses something negative to say about us. Like, and for him to be, he one of the most popular niggas in the world. That nigga can blow up any song that he's singing on his story. He speak out when shit go when, when uh -huh. shit go crazy. And he, he don't, don't get canceled. <laughs> yeah, exactly. You feel me? That's he the keep only... it in the pocket. That's a fact. Look, yo, Jordan ain't doing that. Nigga, niggas get smacked down tomorrow for nothing, bro. Jordan is right. it ain't my business. You feel me? On some real Brooklyn shit. That's but LeBron fact. is a real like on some real man shit, like he hold it down, bro. He's a real fucking uh, uh, a real role model, bro, for what the NBA is, bro. He not just you could tell how he move. He ain't just doing it for him, bro. He doing mm -hmm. it for the people, bro. That nigga do yeah. shit for the people, bro. So and it's only a few niggas like that. So until I see a nigga that could hoop at an elite level and outside of that handle business and still not have none of no smut on his name mm -hmm. at this level come on bro nah. That's okay. i don't know if y'all seen that uh shave room video of the baby letting the young nigga rap word that that little nigga that ran up to him was like yo can i rap for you mm -hmm. if y'all don't know that's the intro of the check-in tv that's oh. the little nigga oh word niggas don't even know that Nah, shout out to him. You feel me? And it's like, you, you feel what I'm saying? And it's like, I done seen something in that little nigga years ago. And that was three years ago when I made him do that intro. You I seen him on the street the same way that he stopped the baby you, and all yeah, that. I was driving and he stopped me. He was like, yo, yo, yo. And I said, I said, you over here asking me for money <laughs> every day. I mm -hmm. said, you want to make some money for real? I'm going to start this YouTube. Mm -hmm. I said, you want to make it? I said, I got you. Every time I see you, I'm going to give you money. Mm -hmm. Gave him $20. What you need me to say? Hey, this is check-in TV. Mm -hmm. And then y'all hear a voice. That's him. That's love. But he be on his grind, though. You, you said me? three years, and he's he still running down. He's still running. Yo, and I'm going to be real. That nigga got a knot of money. Yo, you, <laughs> you go give him the, whatever you give him. That nigga going to be like, thank you. Pull out a knot with a rubber band, throw that whatever you gave him on top. <laughs> yeah, don't get the little nigga yeah. hot, bro. He don't get the little nigga hot, bro. Niggas know that. Niggas know that though. If you really know that little nigga, you got the other little nigga looking for. Like, yo, who that rapper nigga? Bro, everybody know him in Miami. Oh, oh he in the Yams. Everybody know him in Miami. Oh, everybody know him in Miami okay. bro. Okay, that's what's that's up. That's why I met him in the heart of little Haiti, getting it. You feel me? So. Yeah, shout, shout out, out to him, him man. Bro. Chase your dream, bro. That's Appreciate you. He only ten years history. old, bro, and he don't know that shit that he did got me far. <laughs> that little up. shit that he did got me far. You feel what I'm up. saying? That's so, what's up. That's what's up. Shout out to him, though. So what, what's good? And bro? Yeah, well, while we got shout out, shout out to Jamaica, bro. Sixty that's years of independence. You that's know, that's fact, our people. Yo. That's a you fact. know, that's our heritage and all mm -hmm. that, our lineage, though. Shout out to them, too, bro. That's a fact. Your man, Batman team. Yeah, and all that. Yeah, <laughs> Facts. Mm -hmm. Yeah, man. So, in another joint, too, this nigga Lil Wayne, bro, they just had the Young Money reunion concert and all that. Okay. Drake Gilly didn't it. show up, right? <laughs> <laughs> nah, I don't think Gilly was Young Money, bro. But, yeah. um, but, um, how yeah, but, um, he talking about he about to drop the call to six, bro. Okay. My, I just wanted to know how you feel about that. Like in this era, like do Wayne still need to put out music? Like, is there people that still gonna, looking checking for Lil Wayne or Lil Wayne album? Be still hot out here. Lil Wayne putting out music like for the niggas. Like, uh, he know there's some fans that's gonna listen to it. Like how you know Nas put out albums. Mm -hmm. You know how Nas know he still got them older heads that's been to listen. Yeah, but Nas content matches that group. Yeah, exactly. Little, yeah, that's like, why I don't know because Lil Wayne been he ain't dropped shit in a minute. So it's like, where are you going with this? Like, yeah. are you gonna put Young Boy on your shit, or are you gonna put? You know what I'm saying? Oh, that's what he might do. Collab with a bunch. Oh, you of might go. Are you gonna go with Benny the Butcher? Cause are you gonna go with real That's the good thing about Wayne though. He could you know go with. Saying? He could go Anybody. either way. He could go yeah. both ways. So and on one project, he could put it all together. But it's just like his content, like mm -hmm. what he rapping about. Is that is I that gonna hit real. with the youth? 
because people his age done that that the people that he was rapping for his age group, we grew I up. feel like they yeah, they yeah, mature. They're not trying to hit a lot of people. Yeah, like pizza and all that yeah, weird like, like, shit he be talking about. Like, yeah. yeah. It's like, bro, no. Like niggas is not trying to So and, I don't know. I don't know if it won't do if it doesn't do well, if the album dropping it doesn't do well. Mm-hmm. Like is that like is it like Jordan playing for the Wizards? Yes. Like you see I like, feel it is because I feel like if you're gonna do a Carter Mm-hmm. Make it an iconic album, yeah. Because I'm tired of it's like it's like when they did the um, remember the cookout? The, the, the album. Movie, the I mean the album, the, the movie, movie with Queen Latifah and John. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they made a second one. Oh, they did. That, yeah, <laughs> exactly, exactly. Yeah, it's they just made like Belly one. Two, bro. It's just like Belly Come Two. On, bro. Like that's what I'm saying. Like yeah, if you're you gonna give us some down. good food, yeah. make sure it's cooked right. You right, know what right, I'm saying? Right, it's right. like I don't want no. Shit that's not gonna be iconic to mm-hmm. I can bump, like you know what I'm saying. The Carter One, mm-hmm. Carter Two, give me something like that. We mm-hmm. in a time right now where we need good music, mm-hmm. cause the shit that we getting is just watered down. Some shit to fuck up the the the, the place where we living in right now, like and yeah. we don't got time for that. If you a legend, give us some iconic shit. Don't give us no right now music. Bobby you know new, Bobby new shit drop. You heard it? Nah, I ain't even listen to him. He been shaking his hips too much. Yeah, but, that's, that's why. But, Bobby, hey, shout out to Bobby, though. Bobby he having nigga, fun, bro. bro. That yeah, nigga yeah. been locked up too long. Yeah, you know and I'm this nigga, he don't give a fuck, bro. I think yeah. niggas make, he, he want niggas like, all right, niggas making fun of my shit. I'm about to go even more crazy. Exactly. Like, he want to eat his, his, so I can't he around him, I'm BBLs. This nigga having fun, bro. Like yeah. he ass in his face. I didn't get it. I didn't get a chance to listen to that shit either. But I, I listened to that Roddy shit. That shit was alright. Roddy. Yeah, oh, yeah I Roddy listened to Roddy, Roddy though. Yeah, Roddy. He been he been saying some little shit. I've been listening. to Yeah, his album was alright. His album. Mm-hmm. Was thing. I know he got out this his situation with Epic, and I mean mm-hmm. he now independent. But it's just like you know, at the same time. You ain't probably even know Bobby dropped the album. That, that's <laughs> yeah, right. I'm saying. Because they're not going to push it to us because Bobby It's independent now. He independent yeah. now. But mm-hmm. I'm going to support his shit, though, for sure. Course, I'm going to definitely rock out and listen. That nigga Young Boy dropped the album, too. That's a fact. You know what I mean? So it's a, I was surprised. There was a lot of people that, that dropped. Mm-hmm. This um this 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 Friday. So it's definitely a good week to tap in and listen to that's some new shit. Real like I ain't been hearing shit from Lil Baby. Like, yeah, people been... He been dropping, right? You know, them shit, they, they ain't do good. They not what I would say is Lil Baby that had me like, okay, yeah. I got to download that shit. Like, he ain't and been dropping. It didn't resonate. It didn't resonate. the same way, right? Yeah, the last Thank two songs, because you okay. could tell, like, because we in, we out here, mm-hmm. so we know, like, the, um, the, uh, she be in the loop. Mm-hmm. Me in the coop, like I that song, got that downloaded on my phone. Yeah, bro. but that song is all right. But I just it's know not, the radio. it didn't do well. Like it's not gonna catch on. Mm-hmm. But, hey, but I don't know what the fuck, little what happened to little baby, bro. You know what it is? He's scared of this Rico. This nigga nah, trying to back you up, think bro. So? He trying he to don't back know up. The rapper There's too many four PF. There's too many four PF niggas in this the street. This is never man. He was the ball and say fuck that's why he trying to back up. You can't get scared up. now. You can't get exactly. scared now. You ready? Right now, the time to be putting out the best, the best of Bro, the best. Right only now. one out. You feel yeah, what I'm saying? Nah. It's like, His last two joints was, I can't remember the other song. He put yo, out. them shits was mid, bro. He tried to put out another joint. Mid, you ain't even hear about it. The Frozen joint he put yeah. out, that shit ain't do good. I heard it, bro. This shit and it's like, mid, this bro. song with Drake is not, to me, you say you like it because you know, it's that Drake catchy shit, mm-hmm. but I'm like nah. Yeah, this the, little the baby, Drake, yeah, on the Drake, Drake shit, shit, yeah, I fuck with yeah, it. It's a it's Drake, Drake song. shit. Yeah, it's, it's little that. baby. You was nah, conforming yeah, to Drake nah, style. Yeah. You should have never. You're just you watering your shit down mm-hmm. to like, and the water is not yo bro. It's not gonna help your situation like at all. Cause like, it's like <clears> we 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 fuck with you either way. How right, you come right, on this shit? Don't right. try to conform to Drake style. That's how. Most artists fuck up when they get on his songs. Yeah, and yeah, yeah. They keep going in that pattern, trying to conform to other. Yeah, artists keep having style. Drake come to your shit. You know that's what, what I'm saying. That, when I'm thinking, um, Drake and Baby and Bro, Khaled, I'm like, oh you remember, shit. You remember when that I see that, it, when I seen it before I heard it, mm-hmm. before I heard it, because I don't listen to the radio. So when I seen it, I was like, oh shit. I'm yeah. like, yo, Baby. Drake and Khaled, I'm this like, this is about to be, be bro. Yeah. I played this shit, I'm like, mm. 
It's and mid. I was like, what the fuck is little the Trey Downs is like, what the fuck is little baby gonna say on this? It's mid. And that uh, yeah, that shit is not it, bro. <laughs> Cal is gonna. They probably put like a million up on that video. Yo, the, for with the real. doctors and all that, and doing all that yeah, extra man. shit, and it's probably not good. I, I would say like with that single, that show was kind of mm-hmm. like a mistake on Cal. Yeah, part. I would have never. Did I think that. he was just trying to give us something because he he I seemed like put, the summer's put Kodak, up. I would put Kodak on that because Kodak a so, little bit more. Yeah, Kodak been eating the summer. Yeah, right he now, been like, going with, crazy. With drops right now, yeah, like. Hell yeah. That you saying boo whatever that shit was yeah yeah yeah, yeah. Cool that's pretty old I'm talking about like, like the new shit with Ice um, you seen that that the new shit with Ice and Red hot, uh, hot boy yeah you got yeah. some shit going like yeah. all that shit like niggas sleep on Kodak Kodak one of the greats bro he one of the little niggas that really be saying something he set a trend he got the niggas with the gold teeth and the fucking oh yeah Florida hands door. down Florida he got the all the little niggas mm-hmm. from Miami up got, them got the door. to Orlando, got their mm-hmm. swag from Kodak. I don't care what none of them mm-hmm. niggas are saying. And he All of them it. rapping like dog. I don't mm-hmm. give a fuck what. And he and Kodak say he got his shit from Plies, and that's a fact. Mm-hmm. You can hear the little Plies influence, yeah, but all these yeah. niggas, hot boy and all them niggas, all that, all that shit. Glock nine, oh Kodak, mm-hmm. Kodak. And they all the way up in Orlando. That's like that's three hours fact. away. That's a fact. So you know what I'm saying? All that in between, even um. Even XXX, when he was yeah. rapping instead of doing that punk rap, mm-hmm. he like was Kodak is really, way. yeah, I think mm-hmm. Kodak is more influential than NBA Youngboy, though, bro. That's a that's a fact, and you see, he came at um, telling the NBA Youngboy fans, fans like, like chill yo, out. chill with that shit, and I feel him because it's like, I go on the post anywhere, like rap stream daily. Why be do it better? This I'm just saying though. I'll be thinking you, like, damn nigga, how unbusy are you for what niggas is commenting? Just turn bro. your comments off if that's the case. That too. Like if 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 you taking pictures and you want somebody to tell you they like it, you know what I'm saying? Like mm-hmm. they'll just hit you on your DM. Like I don't know, but you might not. I I feel him. He shouldn't have to like do this or do that just because of YB fans. But at the same time, bro, you can't control what millions of people do, bro. Like, That's at the fact. same time, like, you just got to accept it, bro. It's not his fault that, you know what I mean? And he ain't blaming him, but I'm just saying, like... I'm just saying, like, his side of the shit. Yeah, like, but it's just like, out, don't like, speak like, on, bro. Like, you yeah. spoke on, bro. You keep yeah. speaking on, bro. And them fans going to keep eating Keep what? getting on you. Don't talk about him. And then you out of sight, out of mind, bro. Y'all, he don't speak on, on Kodak. Yeah, he crazy. don't even speak. He don't. <laughs> like, I don't even think he really run his Instagram for real. You probably tell one of his boys to post yeah, something. Yeah, that nigga is, that, that nigga is far removed from this. That's, that's a fact. That's one nigga you know, that, that he don't give a fuck with about his makeup on, yeah. smoking weed out his cigarettes. That nigga don't give a fuck. Doing that. <laughs> he don't give a fuck. That nigga don't care. <laughs> we gonna put that nigga back in his head tomorrow. That nigga will be all right. That's a fact. So with that all being said, like, what would be a going out message for all these followers and all subscribers? Man, and Appreciate y'all for sure, man. Thank y'all so much for listening to us every week, seven, seven weeks in a row, man. Thank the you, numbers man. is going up. You feel me? You know what I mean? Speaking of perfection, shout out my boy Pasuav, man. He been keeping yeah. me. He got the lit gear on too. Yeah, bro. yeah, yeah. Word. He been keeping it lit for. for Yo, let me get week. lit, bro. Yo, let me yeah. up with some gear, Yo, bro. We gonna put it together. Word. We gonna put it together. That's <laughs> that's possibly my fault. I got you. You know what I mean? But definitely Yo. tapping with my boy. He definitely mm-hmm. been looking out, going crazy since like 16, 2016. And you know, you might catch people out here. Yeah, rocking and shit, but man, I love to support my bro. He been going up yeah. crazy for a minute now. So yo, support, man. man, any brands, yo, y'all trying to send y'all clothes in to get it promoted up? Cause you know we in the top two hundred, man. We gonna promote your shit. Send them clothes in. We gonna yeah, wear that right. shit on the episodes. You feel me? All yeah. like. And with that, my message, because you know I came across some rude shit in my DM <laughs> no, this week, man, bird. Man. I'ma just tell this like this, cause I don't want, you know, people gonna know us for them. She gonna know us for her, man. Humble yourself, yo. Because you know when other people reaching out to you to ask you questions, cause you don't know who could bless you and put you in a better position. Instead of you coming off arrogant thinking that everybody wants something from you. Humble yourself, yo. I don't care what position you in in life, humble yourself. Cause you don't know who could bless you and help you for real. So with that, this episode seven, man, you heard, and stop all that weird shit, and we out, man. <laughs>